Uh, oh, we had a so we had a call so with uh, the report of a suspicious envelope, which then to, with the first in officer, it turned into to a hazardous materials incident because the uh, ambulance or the envelope had caused uh, one or two people to get feeling ill. The envelope was damp, uh, which is unusual. And when we uh, made it a hazmat response, it is a full-level hazmat, which is involves six, seven apparatus, and there, we have a very, very strict protocols as to how we mitigate a circumstance like this. So that was on the 25th floor. There was some confusion. There was a patient on the 29th floor exhibiting signs of flu, which was not the same as the symptoms on the 25th floor. That was a separate medical incident, and we've taken care of that. Currently, there are it, the number of patients has gone from one to six. We now have six patients in quarantine on the 25th floor. Uh, they'll stay there uh, until um, we determine what the product is because of further contamination problems. Unless, of course, they get uh, gravely ill, and then we're going to have to decide how we're going to handle that. Uh, we do have a plan in place if that should occur. Right now, we're keeping them on the 25th. The hazmat team is in their special entry suits and they uh, are now trying to determine what the product is and if it's harmful at all.